right, we're gonna be showing here. I got some L136 Bs and Cs. These are all out of my group of L136 Cs. And so we're gonna see what I have for sale here. These, I don't know, I gotta go through them to see what is what. But just to give you some visual of these fish, let me. get a good shot at some of these. They're developing really good patterns, big bold spots all over the bodies. Majority of them are C's, but I do got a couple B's in there. And the older they get, the better they're looking. Look at this one back here. Let me get a shot of this one. Look at that one. Can you, are you able to see that? The one down on the ground? Can you focus in on that one? Look at that, spectacular. There's quite a few like that in, in here as well. Look at those. I'll zoom in on that. And then we go to the other tank. I got another tank full of them as well over here. See, that's a C there. And then all of a sudden you can see some C's and B's. Look at this one. Really nice. Yeah, those are some C's. I mean B's. But look at that C right there. Very nice. And I got one spectacular one in there. The, I may just keep it. Look at that one. Zoom in on that. Look at the quality on that. The large spots, just beautiful. She almost all white. Beautiful specimen. All right, and I'm gonna let these go. The bees will be let me see. I'll let the bees go for like 50, 60 bucks. And the C's are gonna be 150. So let me know. Then I have, going over here to the next tank, my babies, these are albino L133 albinos, king tigers. I sold one group, there's two groups of six. One group is already sold and getting shipped out on Monday but I do got another enough for one more group. All these fish are from spawns from last season, last winter that I raised up through the summer. They're all doing well. Can you capture that? Very nice quality. Let me see if I can move anything. You can see them running around. It's quite a few, like I said, it's enough for two groups. And these are actually a few spawns because they were the first beginning spawn, so they wasn't big spawns. You can zoom in there, grab those. Yep, very nice. All right, let's move on. Let me get this back in here. And I will be doing a uh, full tank room review or tour pretty soon. But today we're just gonna focus on what I'm selling. Now, what I'm doing here, if you look over to the rack over here, now if you look over here at these racks over here, just zoom out through all the racks, we're gonna be doing this rack, what I'm gonna be doing, I'm gonna be making most of these tank zebra plecos now. So I'm gonna be selling out some of these groups of other ones. They're doing good and they're breeding and they're fabulous fish, but I wanna focus on just zebra plecos on this rack mainly, and then a couple cactus pleco species. So if you look here and zoom in these racks here, you can see I got a group. Um, I think that's a, it's either a, I think it's a trio here in this tank. You can set back to show the whole tank. And then this one, I'm, I'm trying this with more airflow to see if this one more successful. A trio group here. Then I got a trio group down here. And this one is just some grow up. So I got like six, five or six baby zebs that I'm keeping myself. Those from last year's spawn, and I'm gonna keep them. So, and I'm gonna be adding to this group too. So, 
uh, that's the goal is to have a whole rack system look like, like this rack over here. So these are what's gonna be for sale. This is my group of super red, super whites. Look at that, look at the color, zoom in on that. I don't know how many male to female ratio they have bred. I have sold babies. You can look on the past channel to see the quality of babies I have uh, produced. I know I bought majority of them from Dan's Fish. I think it's six total. And then I bought two from Hazel Aquatics, Chew from Hazel Aquatics. I bought two females out of his private collection. So let me see if I can get a couple of them. Hold on one second, see if I can get a couple of them out. You can keep it going, take a picture. And you can also see good videos of them when you look at the pre previous videos in the past. Like I have a couple of videos dealing with these fish, showing up close, the quality of them. You know, super whites do get a little duller when they get older, but these are still, I kept some of the most spectacular ones and they produce very, very well. I got a young one. Uh, let me see if I can get him out. That I kept for one of the spawns in this group and I added it to this group and he is spectacular in color. Can you see that one? S super clean white, thick bar. Look at him now, I'll zoom that in. I kept that one to add to the group. Very nice one. So I know it should be a guaranteed two females because I bought, purchased two adult females then the rest was just a group that I raised up from Dan's Fish, like I said in the past, previously. So a very, very good group. I'll let this group go for 1500 And they are proven producers. I produce quite a few fry from these fish. And it pays for itself. I didn't pr produce more um, in one year that paid for this group over and over. All right. Um, the next thing that I'm gonna be selling is the albino, the babies, the parents of the albino uh, L3 different king tigers. Um, I don't know the male to, ratio, race, male to female ratio with this group. So I'm probably just gonna sell them individually unless somebody just wanna buy the whole group. Uh, make me an offer. I gotta figure out how many is in this group. There's quite a few. And I actually have two um, additional um, what is it, Pleco Ceramics. Um, they're getting in that albino Plecos in here too. From that group, I was trying to breed, uh, do some uh, uh, breeding with those as well. But yeah, I got quite a few in here, but it reached out to me through email. So, and I could sit to this show you if you wanted to buy the whole group, how many is in this group, because I kind of forgot. But they, they breed more than any other Plecos that I have. So I'm always got, every time I look through it, move, things around in this tank, I got fry almost every time. And so, matter of fact, if you could look at the camera now, I'm gonna show you one. Every single time, I just was not kidding. They mass produce for me. Watch, I'm gonna move this around and zoom in. You're gonna be able to see the baby. And, where'd it go? I just saw a fry. Did you see it take off? So I don't know how many in here. There, uh, there she go. Are you ready to see it? Way right behind here. Watch, you got the camera. See the babies? See her? You see it take off? There she go. Got her. Yeah, every time I get a gift, every time I look in this tank, there's babies in here. <laughs> so they breed all the time. So yeah, I, I'm i not sure. Reach out to me, I'll make a deal on this group. We try to set this back. I'll clean it up in a minute. 
But yeah, like I said, these are the ones I'm even considering even this group of um what is it uh my L230 wait the L136 C's I'm considering selling this group as well I love these fish uh I forget how many in this group it's not a big group I think it's only like five in this group but like I said I'm trying to just breed just a one group of fish Stick of one group. Oh, they got babies. Look at the eggs. See that right there? You see it? So now I gotta go through both of these tanks and get the fry out. <laughs> like I said, they... and I don't wanna, since I don't know where the baby's at, I don't wanna mess with the parents and pull them out of caves right now. I want to be able to go through this tank. So yeah, reach out to me about these as well. I can sit, send video or pictures, or you can go back on previous videos and see them as well. But yeah, just wanted to let you guys know what I'm going to be selling out of right now. And uh, and also one more, I forgot all about this. I'm down to my, my L082 um, plecos here. I'm down to just the last two. If you can zoom in, look at that. Look how big that is. It's a good six inch fish, five, six inch fish. It's a carbleco. I got two in there. I'll let that go for 150 a piece. Beautiful specimen. So if you're interested in that, let me know as well. And that's all the time I'm gonna take for that today. Oh, you can get another group while they're looking there just to close it out, just to see just how beautiful these fish are. So yeah, reach out to me. I do overnight shipping. All right, thank you again for watching the video and, and you have a great one.